All right, y'all. It is the month of May, and y'all know what we have to do. We have to start this month off right by doing our May budget. Yeah. Guys, May is a busy ish month for me i think it's kind of busy is it busy i think it's a little busy the main reason why it's busy is because this is the month of my grandmother and my mother's birthday okay and we got to celebrate those queens so let's talk about our may budget the plan we have for our money in the month of may i project that i'm gonna bring in $13,162 in income. This will be after taxes, okay? This is what I plan on doing with that money. $1,536 will go toward the mortgage. $109 is the HOA. $120, the gas bill. $231, the electric bill. And those two things are based off of what they were last month. So hopefully they come in lower, but at this point, we don't know if they will or not. The way we've been going, they've been going up. And I think, y'all, the cost of electricity has went up, hasn't it? Because I've compared these I've compared these bills to what my bills have been in the past. And my bills were a good $50 to $75 lower in the past. Cell phone. For three phones on my plan, $157. The internet service is $70. The security system, $54, and housekeeping, $180. We're expecting to pick up the lawn again. I do have a lawn guy, and that is $135. It looks like my lawn has been cut. We don't have crazy high grass everywhere, so I'm assuming that he has been cutting the grass, so I'm expecting to have a bill soon, and that's what I'm expecting the bill to be, unless he increases his um, rates as well. The purple experience. This is for my purple mattress. I'm making payment plans on this, and this is two hundred dollars for now. Um, we do expect to have this thing paid off in under twenty four months, but in the meantime, we get thirty six months of zero interest um, for this for financing these the mattress and the, the adjustable base that I got for the mattress as well. The paint project. I'm making payments in four installments. And so $1,000 is going to go towards that. And then next month in June will be the last payment that we pay towards the paint project. Insurance. I seen this too. I was like, wait a minute, what? Huh? That's right. $2 for the insurance. And I explained before it's because um, I have a credit on my insurance. And so it's being applied to the bill. So I just have to pay $2 out of my pocket. Yay. Easy pass. We're setting aside $25. YouTube premium, $23. The next four things, groceries, restaurants, household miscellaneous, and fun miscellaneous. I don't have a budgeted number four because I do what I call mindful spending. For all of you who watch my weekly spending vlogs, you know how it goes. Every time I go somewhere, I'm thinking about what am I spending. I'm trying not to spend, and I'm putting things back. That's what it is. And so that's what will populate these numbers right here. What I choose to buy and what I choose not to buy because I want to save my money or put my money towards something else. But I did give myself more permission to spend more money in the area of food. So there's that. Okay. Nails, $80. Appointment is tomorrow. Lashes, $135. Morocco, $608 will go towards that vacation. Kenya, $1,000 will go towards that vacation. And Hawaii, $450 will go towards that vacation. Yes, I'm a vacation holic for those of you who don't know me. Hello, my name is Tanisha. Mm -hmm, that's what I do. I travel. Can't help it. And guess what, y'all? There's some more vacations that's going to be happening as well that ain't even in these budgets just yet. We're going to take care of these things first, okay? 401k, $1,580. Health savings account, $200. Savings will be setting aside $698.
then extra to the mortgage because another one of my goals on top of traveling is to pay off my house one of these days. So we're going to be sending an extra $2,575 there. And then we're also setting aside an extra $878 for giving. And now I'm realizing I forgot to write down how much money is left over. Let me look at my every dollar account and see. Okay. $1,116 is what we have left remaining. And in the beginning, when I first started doing a budget, I did an every dollar budget. And so what that meant was every single dollar that I bought into my life, I gave it an assignment. I sent it somewhere, whether it was savings, whether it was extra on the house, whether it was paying more on a debt or a bill. I did do that. But now that I'm in a place where I can be a little more relaxed around my finances because I am debt free, uh, minus the bed. Don't y'all judge me. Don't y'all judge me. So, but for the most part, I am debt free. And because I have hit a lot of my major financial goals, I can be a little more relaxed. So I leave that $1,116 in my checking account because it makes me feel more abundant to see the money there. And then I move it as I spend it. So when I buy something to eat, I will populate my restaurant category or my groceries category. If the house needs something, I will then itemize it there, right? So that one's... $1,116, yes, it has to feed me for this month, it has to entertain me for this month, and then it just has to tend to all of my desires that can fit within a $1,000 budget. So that's what it is, y'all. That is the plan for May. I'm excited for this month. Oh, wait a minute. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. That eight seventy eight. That's including the money for my mother and my grandmother's birthday. I'm not sure what we're going to do just yet. I need to call my sisters and find out. Yeah. <laughs> I'm all saying that because this video is about to come out and I don't think they be watching my videos like that though. So it's okay. My mom, she be liking different kinds of videos. Not my kind of videos. But. That's what it is, y'all. Thank y'all for being here. I'm going to talk to y'all in the next video. And I'm going to meet y'all down there in the comments. So don't be shy. Don't be shy. Talk to me. Thumbs up the video. And subscribe to the channel. And I'm going to see y'all later. All right? Home to cook spaghetti. That's where I'm on my way to. Peace.